A wonderful opportunity to feature Hill Family Estate, a legendary Napa grower to some of the most well-known wineries in the United States. All right, so this I think is a very unique perspective because we're in downtown Yountville, which is exploding in popularity, both from a food and wine experience. And yet you've been here a while, so you obviously knew something. Tell everyone where we are, how you came to be here. Yeah, so the town of Yountville, I was born and raised. I'm a, uh, what, a, a Yountville native. They call us Yonties. And uh, dad has been growing grapes in the Napa Valley since the late 70s. He has grown grapes for 40 different wineries. <laughs> So you've got the Quintessas, you've got the Cake Breads, you've got the Silver Oaks, you've got the Duck Horns. I mean, there's a lot of great wineries. And not a bad gig from having done it for as long as you have. So the portfolio's grown, the winery's grown. Take me through the history of when you grew up and when it began as dad's idea to where it is today. Sure, that's a great question. So let's go back to 81. Okay. That's when I made my debut on uh, Earth. And it was one of those things where ever since I was maybe this tall, I remember dad taking me out to vineyards and allowing me to have an education derived from nature, if you will. Sure. So I had an instant early connection with mother nature. 80% uh, of what we grow today, we currently sell. All right. Only 20% of our uh, grapes actually go into our core thoroughbred program. I convinced dad in 2001 to jump into the winemaking scene. And that was strictly related off not making a career out of an NBA basketball. Okay. Sorry, I wanted to play NBA basketball, and you know, it was the weirdest thing, Martin. I stopped growing my senior year of high school, so I needed a backup plan, and I went to Dad, and we started with a whopping 240 cases of Merlot, mm -hmm. and we did 639 cases of a blend called Origin. And now, here we are, if you flash ahead, we've added a lot more wines to our portfolio. We're currently between six and 9,000 cases total production. Our wine club has grown by 437% in the last two years. So, you know, it took a while to, to get it right because dad never worked at a winery. Sure. I never had any background experience, but we knew we wanted to be part of this business. And this is the one business where I feel we don't keep anything proprietary. Mm -hmm. If somebody asks, why does it taste this way? How did you get the grapes to, you know, be like this? We're the first to give that information away. And so it, it's been great working um, and learning from a lot of those wineries. His dad established a great rapport and working relationship years ago with them. And I couldn't think of a, um, a better partnership than with Cellar Angels because your fans have bought a lot of other wineries' wines. And it, I'll be thrilled to have our Syrah in multiple wines down the road added to their cellars through this program. We cannot thank Ryan enough for sharing the impressive history of his family's estate. Their commitment is evident in every bottle and the 2011 Syrah is something to behold. Thank you for all your support.